First and foremost, pag nakita ko sila, nakakausap ko sila. So, like, uh, actually, si Jeremy nakatrabaho before. I reached out to him and he was so nice na, you know, mag-accept and, you know, he's open to working. So, I know he's a, he's a really cool guy. Tapos, Miguel, I I knew, I only knew so much nung sa mga videos niya. Pero, he's really chill and, uh, alam niyo, uh, these, these people, uh, kabalik na ng talent nila. Yung, yung, yung pagiging taong-tao lang din nila kasama. Yun yung gust nagustuhan ko kung bakit sila ko trabaho. And Jamiko, I've worked with him so many times na and uh, he too is a... <laughs> so many times na. Kasi mga ilang beses na rin talaga. Uh, um, hands down lang ako sa talent niya. And uh, ano yun, um, ang importante sa akin marunong makibagay yung nakakasama ko. Kasi ako mismo mahiyain ako. And um, pag nahirapan ako mag-approach sa tao, medyo na, doon ay nagiging problema kasi Uh, ayun na, nagkakaila, may ilangan na. Pero with them, sabi nga nila, nag-child kami agad. And uh, ayun, and that's what, what is important sa akin yung mabilis silang makausap, ma-approach, and uh, mag-aang katrabaho. So, yeah. Mm. Sorry, ano nga po yung question? What, uh, what was your first impression of... What's that? Uh, first impression... <laughs> <laughs> first impression of uh, these four guys. First time? Isa isa yung question. Four guys. Yeah, as a group. Um, uh, no, I Yeah, um, but I'm feeling good, like you guys are like scared to approach me because like I I'm, I'm really really shy, talaga. And like um, that I think there's some people that can register as like standoffish or like ayaw kong maki ano um ano how do you phrase it maki halo bilo salamuha kinta lang maki salamuha basta kinta lang yeah but but I mean. Yeah, so I mean, but I don't, I didn't take that against them. I just, um, why don't we just got together and we got to know each other and it, it worked out well. So, yeah. uh, for me, naman, actually, sa, sa mga GC na, sa GC natin pala, kasi uh, I just came from the state. I came, I landed Sunday. And then pagdating ko doon, lumalabas na yung mga notifications galing sa kanila. Kasi we we're, we're doing, we we're doing a, we we're doing a shoot the next day. We we're talking about the shoot. We we're talking about the divisions of how we're going to divide up the song and even the arrangement. So, I saw how driven they all were, uh, because what I said earlier, we all have the one goal, and I saw how how they they all want to get to that one goal, even if it means we have to collaborate and think, uh, ask each other about our, our opinions and all that stuff. So yeah. How about you, Jamie? Oh, the first time na nalaman ko na sila ba yung cover ko, kampanting kampanya po agad talaga kasi um inga dun dun po sa from the group chats and everything like sa drive po nila, lahat po sila um cooperative and like ako nga po nahiya na rin po ako kasi sobrang talented po masyado nila so <laughs> <laughs> parang nandito tama ba nandito so, so yun po um yun yeah, yung first impression ko ta talented lang po tayo rin and babae thank you and congrats thank you ito to isa tanda sa mga uh, talented gusto niya sumali si Aran Sanko Gusto niya makikulab sa inyo. Ano no, there's something in common sa inyong apat. Mostly yung sumali kayo sa contest. Ano na yung feeling niya that time that you have a concert now after kumbaga hindi man kayo pinalad na maging winner, di ba? Pero you're here to ano to do yung yung own thing niyo with your Pinanalo concert. Si Winner si Miko. Sa kapila ko. Sa kapila ko. Sa kapila ko. Ang bagong thing for me kasi ito po yung first major event ko po for, major concert ko for ABS-CBN. Um, thankful po ako, like kung masasabi, thankful ako sa trust po na binibigay sa akin. And di ko naman po gustong parang e-fail sila. So ito pong, parang itong gagawin kong for this concert ay para din po um ma-prove po na na uh, parang parang thank you din po sa kanila for this trust po and of course sa mga supporters din po namin. Ito tawag ko din. Um I think for me uh, actually sa totoo lang I, I I still don't feel it. I still don't feel it but this is like a big milestone but uh, yeah we're doing all these promos and everything but 
alam mo yung ano yung feeling na wow this is really happening this, the thing I was dreaming about since I was a kid have having a concert uh, it's actually happening so parang hindi ko pa ni I can't I still can't believe it but now that the opportunity is here I just want to thank you thank you Star Music first of all uh, for giving me this opportunity and to work with these guys I'm so honored to to be to even be in the same room with these guys to, to work with them so to to have to have this milestone and to achieve it with these guys it's it it really means a lot so i just want to thank you guys i'm sorry to ask you what was the question how does it feel that we have a concert? Yeah. 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 It's so great. It's so great because I, I had the opportunity to um, to work with these guys, first of all, and, um, to collaborate. And this is my first time ever getting to work with a live band on my own my own music that I wrote and produced and like arranged. I'm going to be able to perform for the first time. And so, um, yeah, it's great. It's my dream. It's my dream. So I'm just very happy about it. Yeah. Ayun, tama po yung mga sinabi nila. This is, this is the dream ng isang artist, ng isang singer, ng isang performer na magkaroon ng concert. And um, uh, yun nga, uh, this is uh, yung chance namin to prove to star music nga, like Jamiko said na, you know, meron silang tiwala na and it's our responsibility to show them na this na tama na tinikatiwalaan nila kami. So we're really working hard, even if it means na meron kaming sarili namin group chat na we have to like you know uh, push each other na oy gawin natin to let's uh, meet each uh, magkita kita tayo na mas maaga kesa sa fall time just to have the chance to rehearse it so i think uh, we deserve it actually na na magkaroon ng concert <laughs> hey Miguel i just want to ask what made you decide to cut your hair parang ah, okay. the yeah. I answered this. I answered this earlier, but uh, it was really just. I was sick. I had I'd had long hair for three years, and like uh, um recently in December I did a road trip road trip from Manila to Butuan, so like um, I didn't want to have long hair for that trip because that was gonna be hot as. <laughs> last, lang, last question. Uh, ano yung expect namin dun sa concert? Do you have parang duet, trio, parang a group or solo spot ba? Yeah, you, you can expect us to um, collaborate and like um, give you something very different, and you can also expect to see our individual styles and our individual sort of um, music styles. <laughs> and makita nyo rin pong sumayaw si Miguel dun <laughs> concert. <laughs> Let's pray. <laughs> okay, thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. thank you for so much. I just have one question. Kasi since the title is Song Feels, if there's one song that instantly gives you the feels personally, parang personal choice of a song, what would that be? And short, I don't know. Sound. 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 Isa sa mga parang nostalgic sa akin na kahit nung bata pa ako na hindi pa, hindi ko pa naiintindihan yung love. Gustong-gusto ko na yung kanta ni Shania Twain. Na, na, nalala ko nun bata ako, sabi ko, pakakasalan ko siya. <laughs> Kasi gandang-ganda ako sa kanya noon. So yung kanta niya na kinover ko din, yung You're Still The One. Mm -hmm. Looks like we made it. Look how far we've come, my baby. Might have took the long way. Who knew we get this someday? They said, I bet they'll never make it. But just to look at us holding on. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Um, <laughs> We're, I'm, we're not seeing this in the concert, but the song that always gives me the feels is this uh, really obscure song by Mariah Carey. It's called Underneath the Stars. You guys heard it? No? Anybody? <laughs> we drift into another state of mind And imagine I was yours and you were mine as we lay there on the grass there in the dark Underneath the stars 
Uh, but I think I sang this song uh, during my journey to The Voice. Uh, this is a song that actually almost, uh, when I was rehearsing it before, before I went on stage, but um, uh, I almost uh, started tearing up because of the song. And it's Jealous. And hold on, let me find the chords. <laughs> Yeah, I wished you the best of all this world could give And I told you when you left me There's nothing to forgive And I always thought you'd come back Tell me all you found was heartbreak and misery it's hard for me to say I'm jealous of the way you're happy without me. Ouch. Yeah. Uh, yun sa akin po, kasi may ginawa po akong musical. <laughs> may ginawa, may uh, naging part po akong musical before and itong, nung kinento ko po itong song na to, dun lang po akong, itong song na po akong naiyak. So this is uh, pangako sa'yo. Noon, akala ko ang wagas na pag-ibig Ay sa nobela lang matatagpuan At para pang kahirap na paniwalaan Pangako sa'yo, ipaglalaban ko Sa hirap at kinhawa ang ating pag-ibig Thank you po Thank you! Thank you! Ang mga questions pa po ba tayo na iahabol? Meron pa po ba? Chickeness Chickeness, mukhang kilig na kilig ka kasi siya Kilig na kilig Oo, kilig na kilig ka na Yung iba po Okay na Siyempre, yun na nga Mukhang wala na mga questions Kanina narinig natin solo-solo performance natin